Isn't it a beautiful view from up here? Yes, it is. Luigi? Hello, my haters. What do you think you are doing up on the rooftop? Hey, what do you think you are doing here, bully? Yeah, why don't you just get the heck out of here and leave us alone? Shut up, Princess Peach and Princess Rosalina, and you guys suck. Wait. You. Mario. I am going to get my revenge on you. I can't move. Somebody call 111. Hello 111. Billy pushed Mario off the rooftop. He cannot move. Please hurry and shake him in. I can see his blood from up here. Okay. Thank you. Goodbye. Billy, the police is on their way now and you will be punished. Oh, I hear the police already. Time for you to get punished. Oi, I'm taking you home right now. When Bully got home. Oh no. Please don't tell me that Bully caused trouble again. Yes, Bully caused trouble again. He pushed Mario off the roof to put him in bad condition. Now he needs 24 hour surgery and you need to pay his hospital bill. Oh, 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 Go to your room right now and think about what you have done, young man. Bully. How dare you push me off the rooftop? You are not allowed to do that at all. That's it. I'm pushing you off the rooftop back. I can't move. That's what you get for pushing me off the rooftop. No more pushing me off the rooftop. Never. So Water Bro and Hydro Bro, you two wish to apply for jobs here? Yes. We would like to work here. So can you please promote us? Well, you two can get the jobs, but you two will have to complete one session before I can promote you two. Okay. What do we have to do? Follow me and I'll show you. This is where you two will take your session. All you have to do is to give customer the food he wants. If he chooses the food, you give him the food he wants. If you two do a good job, I will promote you too. I'll be watching you while you do your work. Understand? Yes sir. This should be a piece of cake. Yeah. You can count on us. Are you ready Freddy? Will you stop calling me Freddy? Hey. I was just saying are you ready, okay? Don't take it too serious. Alright. Here comes the customer. I'm very hungry. What the heck is that thing? Is this supposed to be a pumpkin or something? Just give him something he wants, and I expect you two to do a good job. Well, what would you like? Give me the pizza. Here you go. <coughs> give me the pepper. Here's your pepper. No! I don't want that! But you said you wanted the pepper. I believe he actually wanted the condiment. What? Are you kidding me? Give me the pepper. There. You happy now? Give me the french fries. 
Um, home. Give me the water. No! I don't want that. You're kidding me, Hydro Bro. Um, I can explain. Give me the hot dog. Water bro. But I love hot dogs. I don't care. That wasn't for you. Give me the hot dog. Um, a little help, Hydro bro. It's your turn. So do it yourself. Dahlia. Hey, don't call me Dahlia. Wait, I forgot I have my hot dog I was saving for my promotion day. Since I now notice. Wow. That hot dog was mine. He ate it back. He already ate it, and you just had a hot dog. Now stop acting like a spoiled brat. Give me the hamburger. No! I don't want that! Really? Did you just really have to do that? Give me the hamburger. No. You're getting a hot dog instead, because hot dogs are good for you, and it's better than dumb old burgers for you. No! I don't want that. How dare you. Give me the hamburger. Fine. No hot dogs, and no burgers either. You are going to eat me instead. Hydro bro. What in the world are you doing? No! I don't want that! You gotta be kidding me. Give me the hamburger. Many failures later. That was terrible! I'm never coming back here. So I patched Toad. How did we do? Can we get promoted now? Absolutely not. You two did a terrible job. You two weren't giving out the right food and you ate and threw away the food instead. You're both fired. Now both of you leave this building right now or I will call the police. I can't believe we got fired from our job just we did a bad job. Now we can't make any money so we can buy the 3 day vintage club premium pass to Rhythm and Vines festival in Gisborne on the 31st of December. What now? RZFO BIO BMOIER BOJA BMJOW EM JOHER FWP EGM NOER BNFR LGFR GIG FUR WEO OF NEAR HUB GVOY WAVAL BVK JW EG FOGA WRGK I'm gonna do this. Since tomorrow is movie day at school, I'm going to bring bulletproof. Ha 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 at 5 a.m. I just can't wait. Ha 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 if you bring PG-13, you will be warned. If you bring rated R, you will be sent to principal's office for suspension. And if you bring an NC-17 rated film, you will be expelled from this school permanently. And you will never come back to this school ever again. Okay, let's begin. It can be on VHS, DVD or Blu-ray, because this classroom has all three players. Anyways, let's start with Sonic. What movie did you bring? I brought my neighbor Totoro. Good job, Sonic. That movie is rated G. It's Squeak Piranha. What about you? I brought good by Buckeye. Nice job, It's Squeak Piranha. That movie is rated PG. Tails, how about you? I brought Mary Poppins. Good job, Tails. That movie is rated G. Kylie Cooper. What movie is yours? Mine is The Secret Life of Pets. Nice job, Kylie Cooper. That movie is rated PG. Princess Peach. How about you? I brought Mona. Nice job, Princess Peach. That movie is rated PG. Frost Bro. How about yours? I brought The Fate of the Furious. Really? The Fate of the Furious? That movie is rated PG-13. You have been warned. Please don't bring it again. Okay. 
Okay. I won't bring it again. Okay. Spike and stone spike. How about yours? I brought Alien Covenant. And I brought Resident Evil, the final chapter. Spike and Stone Spike! Those movies are in bar! That's it! Go to Principal's office right now for your suspension! And finally, Dark Hammer Bro! How about yours? I brought Bulletproof. Dark Hammer Bro! What the flying heck is wrong with you? That movie is rated MC-17, and that movie is inappropriate! That's it! I had enough of you! Principal's office! Right now! So Dark Hammer Bro, why are you crying in my office? Go home right now. Dark Hammer Bro, we can't believe you brought a rated NC-17 movie. That's it. You're grounded, 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 grounded for 1,500 months. Go to your room right now. I can't hold it anymore. I really need to poop. Duh. Much better. Now I am going to flush the toilet. Oh no. The toilet is about to flood the bathroom. I need to get out of here. I need to use the bathroom. I don't want to poop my pants. Oh, my, God. The toilet is clogged, and it flooded the whole bathroom. Oh, no. I think I'm going to. No, 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 no. I can't believe I pulled my pants. But he clogged the toilet and made a flood. I think I know who clogged it. Boomerang bro. Get over here right now. What is it, Dad? Did you clog the toilet and make a flood in the bathroom? Yes, I did. How dare you clog the toilet and make a flood? Due to the toilet being clogged, I couldn't use the bathroom when I pulled my pants. That's it. You're grounded, 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 grounded for over 20,000 days. Go to timeout chamber now, or I will send you to Hispaniola. Well, yeah. Hey Charging Chuck. We have some exciting news. We're going to Great Wolf Lodge with Princess Peach and her friends. Yeah 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 I'm finally going to Great Wolf Lodge. Yeah. And there's more. If you behave at the Great Wolf Lodge with Princess Peach and her friends. You will be in grounded. Now let's get in the bus that's going to Great Wolf Lodge. Four hundred minutes later. Okay, charging Chuck. Have fun and be good. Hey guys, can I go on the water slide? Okay. Just make sure you stay with us. And don't wet yourself while you are going down. Besides, you have a really bad habit of doing that. I know, I know. Just stop talking and let's go. Alright, Charlie and Chuck. Just wait for Mario and Sonic and we will go. Five minutes later. Screw this line. I just want to go down the slide. Charlie and Chuck. Be patient or else I'm pushing you down the slide with me. Fifteen wasteful minutes later. Yeah. This is so awesome. I'm so glad I'm here. This is the best day ever. Woohoo! Hello. I'm stuck. These four idiots are in the way. Ten minutes later. 
Oh, great! Now we're stuck. That's it. I'm going to take care of these idiots. Wait, Wait charge, charge and chuck. chuck. You no, don't no, know no, what no, you no, are no, doing. No. Please don't do it, charge and chuck. You had to kill four people stuck in this slide. You made Chow cry. Let's just go to the wave pool before someone finds out about this. Hey, Mr. Lifeguard. Nice view from up here. Hey, Amy Rose. Why are you lying down? I'm just enjoying the view from down here. Attention guests. HBO will be playing Captain Underpants. A first epic movie near the wave pool. We hope you enjoy the movie. Yay. Captain Underpants, the first epic movie is on. Oh no. Not Captain Underpants, the first epic movie. I hate the movie. I got to do something to prevent people from getting into the wave pool. Wait. I know. This is the one thing that always guards people. I guarantee that people will get out of the wave pool because of this. Ha 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 ha. Hey everyone. There's whale sharks, sharks in, in the wave, wave pool. Ten minutes later. Attention guests. That was a hoax. There are no whale sharks in the wave pool. Someone made a point that there was whale sharks in the wave pool. We make sure that this won't happen again. Charlie and Chuck. What the heck were you thinking? You just scared almost everyone in the wave pool. If you didn't want to watch Captain Underpants, the first epic movie, you could have just went on the slide instead. Let's go to the other water park right now. Ugh. Do I really have to do Bigfoot Pass? Charge and Chuck. Just do it. You'll be fine. Oh, and wait your turn. Are you fucking serious? Cosmo is stuck between the foot pass. Charlie and Chuck. Wait until Cosmo falls off or she finishes. No. Let me take care of her. Oh no. Not again. Don't, Don't do, it. do it. You're, You're gonna... gonna... Charlie and Chuck. This is the second time you have killed or severely injured someone. You're so lucky you're not in jail. Um, we'll be back after this commercial break. You know what, Charlie and Chuck? Just behave tomorrow or else you are in big trouble. Good night. The next day. Welcome to Dunking Donuts. How may I help you? I want 20 million donuts and 20,000 hash browns. Oh, and 200 kilolatas. Charge and Chuck. That's too expensive and unhealthy. Can't you just order less? Fine, just give me one of each. Because of this I hope you are happy now, Princess Daisy and Sonic. Really? Now you are just being rude. Let's just grab our food, and we'll head to the arcade. Ten minutes later. Donna, this ball won't go into the container. I really wanted 1,000 tickets. Oh well. I will just go play something else in the arcade. Oh boy. Time to earn some tickets. Throw ball one. Done it. Throw ball two. <gasps> That's it. Throw ball three. Six pointless throws later. This last ball better get in. Yay. You know what? Fuck. This. Game. Oh no! I lit it on fire. I better get out of here. What's that smell? Oh no! It's fire. Everyone get out now. Get over here right now. Charge and Chuck. I cannot believe you destroyed the Great Wolf Lodge. 
Now we have to pay $100 million to repair the entire Great Wolf Lodge. And thanks to you, we also will be paying the hospital bill because of what you did, and we will be going to the funeral at the people stuck in the slide. That's it. You are so grounded 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 for 1000 weeks. Now go to your room and think about what you have done young man, or else we will send you to Spain, and no more Great Wolf Lodge for you. I'm going to rant on Nature Cat. Ten minutes later. Done. Now time to watch it. Nature Cat. What? More like stupid cat. Oh my god. This show sucks. This show is about four characters and they like to go on failure adventures together. Nature Cat is stupid. I bet when water touches him, he'll be a scaredy cat. Hal is very gay, and he has the same voice actor who voiced Panda from We Bear Bears. Daisy doesn't know how to use her tablet right. And Squeaks is a dumb dumb. The animation is gay. The songs are dumb. And the music is stupid. I hope this show gets cancelled soon. Do you know who likes this show? VTM on YT. He watches that show every day. Do you know who hates this show? Tupliss and Popple. They both think that show is stupid. Nature Cat sucks. And so does the good dinosaur. The Lion Guard is one million times better than Nature Cat. End of rant. Rookie. How do you rant on Nature Cat? That's it. You're grounded 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 until this show gets cancelled. And for your punishment, I'm sending you to Spain. Oh no. Not Spain. Anything but Spain. No 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 Yes 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 Get in the car right now at Auckland International Airport Good afternoon Welcome to Auckland International Airport How can I help you I would like one ticket for my son Rookie to Spain please. Okay. Here you go. Thank you. And this is for you Rookie. You're going to Spain, because you made a rant on Nature Cat. And don't you dare escape from Spain. Because if you do, you will be grounded even more. Now I'm leaving, and I hope me and your mum will never see you again. So, goodbye. Man. This sucks. I'd rather play Mario Party 10 on my Wii U right now. Several hours later. Flight 449 to Spain is now boarding on gate 16. Repeat, flight 449 to Spain is now boarding on gate 16. Welcome to flight 449 to Spain, in Europe. The flight to Madrid, Spain via Dubai is 26 hours. Enjoy your flight. 26 hours later. We have now arrived at Spain, in Europe. Thank you for traveling on Emirates Airlines. We hope you enjoyed your flight. Have a nice day. Why do I get sent to Spain? Welcome to Madrid, Spain. The white area is for unloading passengers. There will be no parking. Later. Oh no. No I'm speaking Spanish, which is their language in Spain. Can my life get any worse than this? Thirty-one hours later. Hooray! I finally made it back to Auckland, New Zealand. So long, get happy.
Yes. Home sweet home. Now that I'm back home, I'm going to the video store and buy Rough Night on Blu-ray. At the video store. Hi. Welcome to the video store. How may I help you? I would like to buy Rough Night on Blu-ray please. Okay. Here you go. Thank you. You're welcome. Come back soon. Now that I got Rough Night on Blu-ray, I'm going to watch it right now. Later, after Rookie watched Rough Night on Blu-ray. Wow. That was a great movie. Now I'm going to make a grounded video out of Steffi B and make a VHS opening to Despicable Me 3 from 1999 by Paramount. Real, not fake. Later, after Rookie made a grounded video out of Steffi B and made a fake VHS opening to Despicable Me 3 from 1999 by Paramount. Real, not fake. Yes. I made a grounded video out of Steffi B and made a VHS opening to Despicable Me 3 from 1999 by Paramount. Real, not fake. Since my parents are still at work, I'll go off to see Mother. In theaters. Let me guess. Rookie Escape from Spain made a grounded video out of Steffi B and made a fake VHS opening to Despicable Me 3 from 1999 by Paramount. Real, not fake. No. It's strongly fake. I agree with you, Lumpy Toasters. Despicable Me 3 was made by Universal and Illuminati, not Paramount, and it was released in June 14, 2017, not 1999. Despicable Me 3 wasn't even made in 1999. And he also got Rough Night on Bull Ray. Rough Night on Bull Ray is rated R. He has to be 18 to watch it, but no. That's it. We're calling his parents right now. Three hours later. He should have not escaped from Spain. Bought Rough Night on Bull Ray, made a grounded video out of Steffi B, and made a fake VHS opening to Despicable Me 3 from 1999 by Paramount. Real, not fake. I know. He is going to be in very deep trouble when he gets home. Oh no. I'm busted. Oh yes you are. Rookie. How dare you escaped from Spain, bought Rough Night on Bull Ray, made a grounded video out of Steffi B and made a fake VHS opening to Despicable Me 3 from 1999 by Paramount. Real, not fake. Rough Night on Bull Ray is rated R. We told you not to watch rated R movies. Plus, making grounded videos out of Steffi B or other users on YouTube can get you terminated. And Despicable Me 3 was made by Universal and Illuminati, not Paramount, and it was released in the 14th of June 2017, not 1999. And what else did you do after that? Um, I saw Mother in theaters. Ricky, we can't believe you saw Mother in theaters. That movie is rated NC-17. We told you not to watch NC-17 rated films. And Mother, movie is inappropriate. Ricky, you are grounded, 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 grounded big time. That's right. You're grounded big time, because you escaped from Spain, bored rough night on Bull Ray, made a grounded video out of Steffi B, made a fake VHS opening to Despicable Me 3 from 1999 by Paramount. Real, not fake. And saw an NC-17 rated film called Mother. In theaters. But guys, I'm very sorry. No! Your apologies won't cut it this time, and your apology is denied, and for this, it's time to give you some punishments. First punishment, slappings. Next punishment, ass beatings. And finally, putting a nappy on you. Oh no. Not nappies. Anything but nappies. Oh yes you are wearing those nappies. Now lay on the floor. But lumpy toasters. On the floor, now. Okay fine.
Ouch. That hurts. It's throbbing me. I don't care if it's throbbing you. Now you will go pee, pees and poo poos in your nappies, and you will never use your toilet ever again, and I will burn all of your underwear and smash the toilet. Now I'm gonna call my friends to come over here and teach you a lesson. 40 minutes later. Oh, well, rookie. It looks like you have tons of visitors to see you. These are some of Lumpy Toaster's friends, Microsoft Sam friends, Nintendo characters, plus your teacher and principal. And they are all gonna give you punishments and teach you a lesson. Starting right now. I'm Tom Russell, and I can't believe you ran it on Nature Cat and got sent to Spain. I'm Neighborhood Animation. I cannot believe you escaped from Spain and bought Roof Knight on Blu-ray. You know that movie is rated R. I'm Steffi B, and I can't believe you made a grounded video out of me. You know that making grounded videos out of users on YouTube can get you terminated. I'm Weatherster 4000 video. I heard that you made a fake VHS opening to Despicable Me 3 from 1999 by Paramount. Real, not fake. I'm Scarlet the Rave Angel Princess. Rookie. Despicable Me 3 was made by Universal and Illuminati, not Paramount. I'm Dave Olaru, and Rookie. Despicable Me 3 was released on the 14th of June 2017, not 1999. I'm Boss Master, and I can't believe you saw Mother. In theaters. I'm Leon Francis. Rookie. Mother is rated NC-17. You're not old enough to see that movie. I'm Sarah West. You should know that you are way too young for rated NC-17 films, because NC-17 rated films are inappropriate. I'm Benjamin Santogatti, and you should be banned from watching NC-17 rated films. I'm Ryan the Meme Maker 1998, and you should be banned from making fake VHS openings, because you have no right to do that. I'm VTM on YT, and you're a very bad Mario enemy from Mario and Luigi. Superstar Saga series. I'm Jack the Maker Guy, and you should be banned from rated R films as well. I'm Weatherstar 4000 Video Fanatic 2005, and if you beat me up, you're going to get beat up by me. I'm Baby Mario Brothers. If you make a rant on Weatherstar 4000 Video, I will make a rant on you. I'm Junior Garcia, and you should be banned from stealing stuff that don't belong to you. I'm Mr. Floydster 2. And don't you even think about reporting my videos on YouTube. I'm Crimson Zoct Productions, and you are one of the worst Mario enemies I have ever seen. I'm Abdullah as Cutie, and you deserve to get punishments for what you have done between 2014 and 2017. I'm Suya, and you don't deserve any respect because you always cause trouble. I'm Microsoft Mike, and if you call me a lady and say I talk like a lady, I will send your sorry ass to the audience. I'm Microsoft Mary, and if you dare call me a man and say I talk like a man, I will give you bunch of ass beatings. I'm Rhea Rover here Scotty, and if you steal my bologna sandwiches, I will send your sorry ass to the fifth dimension, and if you fire me, I will kill myself, and if you deny responsibility, you will be guilty of perjury. I'm Dua, and if you call me Shatso and mess around with me, I will throw you across your bedroom, and I will give you hard wedgie, and you will be covered in skin marks. I'm Mario, and you are not allowed to come to my girlfriend's castle because you're such a troublemaker. I'm Luigi, and you're not allowed to come to our house as well. I'm Princess Rosalina, and if you cause a meteorite to damage my home in the galaxy, you will be one sorry Mario enemy. I'm Yoshi. And you are worse than you from Mario and Luigi Partners in time. I'm Toad, and you should be banned from bullying people as well. I'm Mr. Game and Watch, and you are a very bad friend of mine, and I really hate you. I'm Donkey Kong, and if you steal my bananas, I will punch you really hard in the face. I'm Diddy Kong, and if you mess with me, I will swap you with a giant barrel. I'm Dixie Kong, and if you pull my hair, I will pull your horns off. I'm Sonic. And if you push me off the rooftop, I will put you in jail for eternity. I'm Cream, and if you steal the teacher's job and tell me to go to principal's office, I will be eat you up. I'm Tails, and you are one of my least favorite character of all time. I'm Pac-Man, and if you steal my peg dots, I will eat you for lunch. I'm Julie Smurf, and you are a bad 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 student of mine. 
and I'm Principal Bianca, and I agree with Julie Smurf, and you are also a bad 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 student of mine. This will teach you a strong strict painfully severe lesson. You will do 500,000 pages of homework every day until you graduate. You will be wearing nappies for the rest of your life. We will also delete all of your accounts on the internet. You will also do tons of chores and community service. We will also take Rough Night on Blu-ray away from you and give it to Rare Yellow Woo at B. You are also banned from making fake VHS openings for good. You are also banned from watching NC-17 rated films. There will be no porn, no peaches and cream, no rated NC-17 films, no sausage party, no Grand Theft Auto, no Fifty Shades of Grey, and others that are pornographic. You will watch shows like Barney, Bob the Builder, Teletubbies, K.I.U., Dora the Explorer, and more. You will also forget your memories captured by porn. You will also play educational and video games like Computer Classroom, Read Your Rabbit, Leapfrog, and other educational and video games that are not pornographic. You will also watch primetime shows like Shortland Street, Coronation Street, Home and Away, Neighbors, The Simpsons, Family Guy, American Dad, and more primetime shows. You are also forced to play with kid toys as well. You will also play Crash Bandicoot and Spyro the Dragon games that are not pornographic. You will also listen to music like Chicago, Foreigner, Toto, Bonnie Tyler, Paul Young, Cindy Walker, Roxette, The Police, BGs, and other artists you hate as well. You will also forget your memories captured by NC-17 films and theaters. There will also be no fast food places, no internet accounts, no hanging out with your friends, and furthermore, you will also go to military school, and do the obstacle course every day without any breaks. You will also go to summer school along with your 500,000 pages of homework every day until you graduate. You will also go to night school as well. You will also forget your memories captured by rated R films as well. You are also banned from prank calling 111 as well, because it can get you arrested. You will also forget your memories all about name calling people bad names as well. You are also banned from ranting on Weather Star 4000 video or other famous people on YouTube and social media for good. You will only eat kid food, logs from trees, chicken feet soup, rab burgers, sardines, raw eggs, Swiss cheese, grape nuts, prunes, and other disgusting stuff as well. You are also forced to eat out from the rubbish bin as well. You are also forced to eat on the floor from now on. We will also take your laptop away and give it to Aussie VHS and DVDs. We will also turn your bedroom into a girl's bedroom, and we will paint the walls red and pink and replace all of your stuff with girl's stuff. You will only need very cold water when you need to take a shower or bath. You are also forced to drink volcano lava sauce, and it will really burn your tongue off. You will only have cold breakfasts, cold lunches, and cold dinners as well. You will only need boiling water whenever you need to wash your hands. You are also banned from smoking recreational drugs including cannabis for good. You will also go to summer camp for troubled teens, and you will also be doing jumping jacks and push-ups every day without any breaks. You are also banned from making grounded videos out of me or other users on YouTube because that will get you terminated. You are also forced to play with girl toys as well. You are also banned from going to places and doing things while grounded. You are also forced to sleep outside from now on. And if you keep this up, you will be grounded even more, and you will be sent to Netherlands and other non-English speaking countries. I agree with everyone. Me too. Get in the house and get your bar to your room right now or else we will send you to Netherlands. Hi, I'm Dark Sledge Bro. Today I am going to crash Facebook. Ha 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 ha. But first, I need somebody to take a good enough picture of me so I can crash the entire website. I know. I'm going to call Dark Hammered Bro to come to my house and take a picture of me that will trend. Man. I'm so bored. 
I don't know what to do today. Oh, there goes my phone. I wonder who's calling me. Hello? Hello Dark Hammer Bro. Hey Dark Sledge Bro. So, what do you need? Can you come to my house and take a photo of me so good that will crash Facebook? Sure. I'll be there in five minutes. Five minutes later. Okay Dark Sledge Bro. I'm here. So, what do you want me to do now? Take this camera and then take a really good photo of me so good that it will crash Facebook. Okay. 90 seconds later. Wow. This picture definitely looks like it will crash Facebook once we post this picture for sure. Really? I want to see. Oh yeah. Of course, this picture will crash Facebook. Okay. Time to post this picture. Later, after Dark Hammer Borrow posted this picture on Facebook. Time to check the latest trends on Facebook. What's wrong, darling? There was an inappropriate trending picture on Facebook. Wait a minute. Dark Sledge Bro was the one in that picture. That's it. Let's call his parents right now. You said it, baby Birdo. Hello. Dark Sledge Bro's parents. Your son Dark Sledge Bro posted an inappropriate trending picture on Facebook. Can you ground him, please? Okay. Thanks. Goodbye. Meanwhile, back with Dark Sledge Borrow and Dark Hammer Borrow. Holy crap. 20,000 views and over 1,500 likes. This is so awesome. Now we're famous on Facebook. Oh no. Facebook crashed. Dark Sledge Bro, Dark Sledge Bro, Dark Sledge Bro. Get your troublemaking butt downstairs right now. Dark Hammer Bro, what in the world are you doing here? Um, I helped Dark Sledge Bro post that picture on Facebook. Oh my god. That's it. Dark Hammer Bro. Go home right now while we ground Dark Sledge Brawl. Dark Sledge Brawl. How dare you post an inappropriate picture on Facebook and crash the entire website. That's it. You're grounded 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 for 555 years. Go to your room right now or else we will send you to Holland. At Dark Hammer Borrow's house. Dark Hammer Bro. How dare you help Dark Sledge Bro post an inappropriate picture on Facebook and crash the entire website. That's it. You're grounded 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 for 9,000 years. Go to your room right now, or else we will send you to Holland. Wow. Attention everyone. Get out of the pool, because we hear thunder coming to us. If you get in the pool while 30 minutes is going, you will be banned from this pool for a month. Repeat. If you get in the pool while 30 minutes is going, you will be banned from this pool for a month. Mom, why do I have to wait for 30 minutes? Because Dark Hammer Bro. We hear thunder. So we have to wait for 30 minutes. I don't care about the thunder or 30 minutes. I want to get in the pool. No Dark Hammer Bro. Didn't you hear what the staff said? He said if you get in the pool, you will be banned from this pool for a month. Fine. I will get in the pool myself. Dude, get off the pool now or you will be banned for a month. I agree with Tails. Dark Hammer Bro. Get out of the pool now or else you will be banned for a month. I agree with Tails and Cosmo. 
Get off the pool right now or else you will be banned for a month. What is going on? Dark Hammer Bro disobeyed your attention. Oh. No. Dark Hammer Bro. How dare you disobeyed my attention. That's it. You are banned from this pool for a month. Go home right now. Dark Hammer Bro. How dare you disobey the pool manager's attention and get banned from the pool for a month. But mum and dad. I'm sorry. Apology unaccepted. You're grounded 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 for 5,000 years. This means no TV, no computer, no internet accounts, no fast food, no Minecraft, no Wii U, no Nintendo Switch, no Xbox One, no PlayStation 4, no Rhythm and Vines, and lots more. And we will give away all of your stuff to Goodwill. Now go to your room and think about what you have done, or else we will send you to Holland. Wow. Okay class. Today we will be doing a few math problems. What is 5 times 2? Come on class. Don't be shy. Just give it your best shot. Yes, Larry Koopa. 12. Okay. Now let's try again an answer from someone who is not a complete idiot. Anyone? Come on. Don't be shy. I think I know the answer, Microsoft Sam. Shut up, fat boy. Hey. Don't call me fat boy, you f***ing moron. Stormborrow. Did you just say the if word? Moron? No, he's talking about. You can't say in school, you f***ing fat. Thunderborrow. Why the f*** not? Stormborrow. Did you just say again? Vortex borrow. <coughs> Twister borrow. What's the big deal? It doesn't hurt anybody. <coughs> How would you like to go see the principal? How would you like to suck my? <gasps> what did you say? Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Actually, what I said was, How, How would you, you like, like to, to suck, suck my? Microsoft, Microsoft Sam. Sam. Holy food. Well, Storm Bro, Thunder Bro, Vortex Bro, and Twister Bro. I'm very disappointed in you for cussing. As for that, I have no choice but to expel all four of you. Go home right now. Storm Bro, how do you cuss in class and get expelled? That's it. You are grounded, 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 grounded for 500 weeks. Go to your room right now, you good for nothing fat boy. Wow. Thunder bro. How dare you cuss in class and get expelled? That's it. You're grounded, 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 grounded for 99,999,999,999 years. Go to your room right now, you good for nothing cusser. Wow. Vortex bro, how dare you cuss in class and get expelled? That's it. You are grounded, 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 grounded for 200 decades. Go to your room right now, you good for nothing troll. Wow. Twister bro, how dare you cuss in class and get expelled? That's it. You're grounded, 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 grounded for 400 months. Go to your room right now, you good for nothing troublemaker. Man, I don't understand why I have to come to school every weekday mornings at 8 o'clock a.m. Why won't my parents just let me sleep in? Because Dark Sledge Bro. The reason you have to come to school is because whenever you graduate out of high school, you will need a good reputation for if you want a better job. Also, it is illegal for you just to stay home and wag all the time, unless you are legally homeschooled. Rules are rules. So instead of whining like a crybaby, how about you get your butt to class, huh? Okay Tails. I was just bored because I have been wanting to know what their smoke breaks. No. 
We never go outside anymore. Instead, we have study hall, where you just stay inside and work your butt off. Now get to class, idiot. No 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 I want to go outside I want to go outside I want to go outside GRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRRR
I did buy a fitness ball while grounded. Oh my freaking god. Dark Sledge Brawl. How dare you buy a fitness ball while you are still grounded. That's it. You're grounded 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 for 700 years. Go to your room right now. There are... Dark Sledge Bro. Stop crying like a baby and go to bed. So, virtual virus and dark virtual virus. You two wish to apply for jobs here? Yes, Miss Steffi B. We would like to work here. So can you please promote us? Well, you two can get the jobs, but you two will have to complete one session before I can promote you two. Okay. What do we have to do? Follow me and I'll show you. This is where you two will take your session. All you have to do is to give customer the food he wants. If he chooses the food, you give him the food he wants. If you two do a good job, I will promote you two. I'll be watching you while you do your work. Understand? Yes, madam. This should be a piece of cake. Yeah. You can count on us. Are you ready, Freddy? Will you stop calling me Freddy? Hey! I was just saying are you ready, okay? Don't take it too serious. All right. Here comes the customer. I'm very hungry. What the heck is that thing? Is this supposed to be a pumpkin or something? Beats me. Just give him something he wants, and I expect you two to do a good job. Well, what would you like? Give me the pizza. Here you go. <coughs> give me the pepper. Here's your pepper. No! I don't want that. But you said you wanted the pepper. I believe he actually wanted the condiment. What? Are you kidding me? Give me the pepper. There. You happy now? <coughs> Give me the french fries. <coughs> Give me the water. No! I don't want that. You're kidding me, Dark Virtual Virus? Um, I can explain. Give me the hot dog. <coughs> virtual Virus. But I love hot dogs. I don't care. That wasn't for you. Give me the hot dog. Um, a little help, Dark Virtual Virus. It's your turn. So do it yourself. Dahlia. Hey! Don't call me Dahlia. Wait. I forgot I had that hot dog I was saving for my promotion day. Since I now noticed. That hot dog was mean. Give it back. He already ate it, and you just had a hot dog. Now stop acting like a spoiled brat. Give me the hamburger. No! I don't want that! Really? Did you just really have to do that? Give me the hamburger. No. You're getting a hot dog instead, because hot dogs are way better than bucket burgers for you. No! I don't want that! How dare you? Give me the hamburger. Fine. No hot dogs, and no burgers either. You're going to eat me instead. Dark Virtual Virus. What in the world are you doing? No! I don't want that! You gotta be kidding me. Give me the hamburger. Many failures later. That was terrible! I'm never coming back here. So Miss Steffi B, how did we do? Can we get promoted now? Absolutely not. You two did a terrible job. You two weren't giving out the right food and you ate and threw away the food instead. You're both fired. Now both of you leave this building right now or I will call the police. I can't believe we got fired from our job just because we did a bad job. Now we cannot make the money to see DJ Netsky and Jisburn on the last days of 2017. What now? 
Hi, I'm Dark Sledge Bro, and today I'm going to ding dong ditch weather stir 4000 videos house. Ha 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 ha. This is going to be fun. So this is where he lives. I'm going to ring the doorbell. Now to hide behind this tree. Hello. Hello. Anybody there? Okay. I think someone just chose the wrong house. Ha 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 ha. That was funny. Time to do attempt number two. I'm going to run off this time. Hello? Jeez. You stupid people out there. Ha 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 ha. He thought there was people out there. Time to do attempt number three. I'm going to hide in his backyard. That's it. If you start ringing my doorbell one more time, I will start chasing you and call your parents. OMG. He's getting super mad now. One last attempt before I go home. Oh crap. Crap 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 crap. I need to get out of here. Oh my god. He's super mad now. He's still chasing me. Get back here you stupid shrubby maker. I bet you went to this location. Ouch. My ankle. No 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 no. He finally caught me. Well well well. Looks like the practical joker was none other than Dark Sledge Bro. Dark Sledge Bro. How dare you think Don ditch my house? You know that's not funny. That's it. Go home right now while I call your parents. And never come to my house ever again. The Dark Sledge Brawl. How dare you ding dong ditch weather star 4000 videos house. You know that doing that kind of prank can get you in trouble. That's it. You're grounded 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 for 750 years. Go to your room right now. The I'm going to wrap orders at McDonald's. Hello, welcome to McDonald's. How may I take your order? I need a double cheeseburger, hold the lettuce, don't be front and sun, no seeds on a bun, be up in this drive through order for two. I got a craving for a number nine like my shoe. We need some chicken up in here and this tizzle for isle my nizzle extra salt on the frizzle Dr. Pepper my brother and other for your mother double double super size. And don't forget the fries crispy. Oh, Bone Goomba. I can't believe you wrapped orders at McDonald's. That's it. I'm calling your parents. No 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 Hello. If this is Bone Goomba's parents, then her son wrapped orders at McDonald's. Please ground him. What? Bone Gamba wrapped orders at McDonald's. Oh my god. He's so grounded. Thanks for telling me about this. Bone Gamba. We can't believe you wrapped orders at McDonald's. That's it. You're grounded 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 for 750 weeks. Go to your room right now, or else we will send you to Holland. You shouldn't have done that. I'm gonna do this. Since tomorrow is movie day at school, I'm going to bring my awkward sexual adventure. Ha 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 At 5 a.m. I just can't wait. 
At school. Okay, class. Today's movie day. We will watch either G or PG rated films. No PG 14, R, or NC 17 films. If you bring PG 14, you will be warned. If you bring rated R, you will be sent to principal's office for suspension. And if you bring an NC 17 rated film, you will be expelled from this school permanently, and you will never come back to this school ever again. Okay, let's begin. It can be on VHS, DVD, or Blu-ray, because this classroom has all three players. Anyways, let's start with Cosmo. What movie did you bring? I brought Descendants 2. Nice job, Cosmo. That movie is rated PG. Tails. What movie did you bring? I brought Despicable Me 3. Nice job, Tails. That movie is rated PG. Green Spritzy Princess. What movie is yours? I brought Trolls. Holiday Special. Good job, Green Spritzy Princess. That movie is rated G. Birdo. How about yours? I brought Descendants. Nice job, Birdo. That movie is rated PG. Shy Guy. How about your movie? That movie is the Lego Batman movie. Nice job, Shy Guy. That movie is rated PG. Ball Borrow. What about your movie? I brought War for the Planet of the Apes. Really? War for the Planet of the Apes? That movie is rated PG-14. You have been warned. Please don't bring it again. Okay? Okay, I won't bring it again. Okay then. Dark Hammer Borrow and Dark Boomer and Borrow. What movie is yours? I brought Baywatch. And I brought Batmans. Oh, Dark Hammer Borrow and Dark Boomer and Borrow. Those movies are rated R. That's it. Go to principal's office right now for your suspension. Wow. Last, but not least, is Dark Sledge Borrow. What movie did you bring? I brought my awkward sexual adventure. <laughs> oh, Dark Sledge Borrow, what the heck is wrong with you? That movie is rated NC-17, and that movie is inappropriate. That's it. I had enough of you. Principal's office, right now. So Dark Sledge Bro, why are you crying in my office? I brug myalkvart seksuel adventur. Evn to kites rated en C sytten. Go home right now. Dark Sledge Brawl. We can't believe you brought an NC-17 rated movie to school. That's it. You're grounded 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 for 1000 years. That means no more NC-17 rated films for life. And as a punishment for bringing an NC-17 rated movie to school. We are sending you to Holland. No 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 we would like one ticket for our son Dark Sledge Bro to Amsterdam, Holland, please. Okay. Here you go. Thanks. And this is for you Dark Sledge Bro. You're going to Holland, because you brought an NC-17 rated film to school and got expelled. And don't even think about escaping from Holland, or else you will be grounded even longer. 
hope so. Goodbye. Man, this sucks. I shouldn't have brought the rated NC-17 movie called My Awkward Sexual Adventure to School. Several hours later. Attention. Flight 130 and 925 to Amsterdam via Seoul is now boarding on gate 33. Repeat. Flight 130 and 925 to Amsterdam via Seoul is now boarding on gate 33. Welcome to flight 130 to Holland, in Europe. The flight to Amsterdam is 46 hours via Seoul. Enjoy your flight. 46 hours later. We have now arrived at Holland, in Europe. Thank you for traveling with Korean Air. We hope you enjoyed your flight. Have a nice day. Why did I get sent to Holland? Welkom to Amsterdam, Holland. De waaitarea is voor een loading passengers. There will be a no parking. Later. Oh no. Now we speaking Dutch, which is the language in Holland. Can meet life get any worse than this? Va <laughs> Seven hours later. Yes. I finally made it back to Auckland. So long Amsterdam. Yay. Home sweet home. Now that I'm back home, I'm going to buy The Walking Dead, the complete season 6 on DVD. At the video store. Hi. Welcome to the video store. How can I help you? I would like to buy The Walking Dead, the complete season 6 on DVD, please. Okay. Here you go. Thanks. Come back soon. Now that I got The Walking Dead, the complete season 6 on DVD, I'm going to watch all episodes of it right now. Later, after Dark Sledge Barrow watched all episodes of The Walking Dead, the complete season 6 on DVD. Wow. That was a great show. Now I'm going to make a grounded video out of Sonic and Amy Rose, and make a VHS opening to My Little Pony, Equestria Girls from 1998 by Vacon. Real, not fake. Later, after Dark Sledge Barrow made a grounding video out of Sonic and Amy Rose, and made a fake VHS opening to My Little Pony, Equestria Girls from 1998 by Viacom. Real, not fake. Yay. I made a grounded video out of Sonic and Amy Rose, and I made a VHS opening to My Little Pony, Equestria Girls from 1998 by Viacom. Real, not fake. Since my parents are still at work, I will go off to see Jigsaw in theaters. Let me guess. Dark Sledge Bro escaped from Holland, made a grounded video out of Sonic and Amy Rose, and made a fake VHS opening to My Little Pony, Equestria Girls from 1998 by Viacom. Real, not fake. No. It's seriously fake. I agree with you Emily. My Little Pony, Equestria Girls was made by DHX Media, Hasbro Studios, and Screen Vision, not Viacom, and it was released on June 15, 2013, not 1998. And he should also know that grounded videos out of popular fictional characters like Sonic and Amy Rose can get him tons of dislikes on YouTube? And he also bought The Walking Dead, the complete season 6 on DVD. That's it. We're calling his parents right now. 152 minutes later. He should have not escaped from Holland, bought The Walking Dead, the complete season 6 on DVD, made a grounded video out of Sonic and Amy Rose, 
and made a fake VHS opening to My Little Pony, Equestria Girls from 1998 by Viacom. Real, not fake. I know. He is going to be in huge trouble when he gets home. Oh shoot. I'm busted. Oh yes you are. Dark Sledge Brawl. How dare you escaped from Holland, bought The Walking Dead, the complete season 6 on DVD, made a grounded video out of Sonic and Amy Rose, and made a fake VHS opening to My Little Pony, Equestria Girls from 1998 by Viacom. Real, not fake. The Walking Dead, the complete season 6 on DVD is rated R. Plus, making grounded videos out of Sonic and Amy Rose can get you tons of dislikes on YouTube. And My Little Pony, Equestria Girls was made by DHX Media, Hasbro Studios, and Screen Vision, not Viacom, and it was released on June 15, 2013, not 1998. And what else did you do after that? Um. I. Saw. Jigsaw. In. Theaters. Dark Sledge Bro! We can't believe you saw Drake Sock in theaters! That movie is rated NC-17! We told you not to watch NC-17 rated films! And that movie is inappropriate! That does it Dark Sledge Bro. You're grounded 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 big time. That's right. You're grounded big time for escaping from Holland, bought The Walking Dead, the complete season 6 on DVD, made a grounded video out of Sonic and Amy Rose, made a fake VHS opening to My Little Pony, Equestria Girls from 1998 by Viacom. Real, not fake, and saw an NC-17 rated film called Jigsaw in theaters. Everyone. I'm very sorry. Will you please accept my apology and forgive me? No. Your apologies and forgiveness is denied Dark Sledge Bro. Now it's time to give you punishments. First punishment, slappings. Next punishment, butt beatings. And finally, putting a nappy on you. Oh no. Not nappies. Anything but a nappy. Oh yes you're wearing nappies. Lay on the floor, now. But Emily. On the floor, now. Okay fine. Ouch. That hurts. It's throbbing me. I don't care if it's throbbing you. You will go pee pees and poo poos in your nappy instead of the toilet, and I will set fire all of your underwear and smash the toilet. Now I will call Lumpy Toasters to come over here and teach you a lesson. One hour later. Wow Dark Sledge Brawl. It looks like you have a lot of visitors here to see you. These are Lumpy Toasters YouTubers, Dave Matson's characters, Mario and Sonic characters, plus your teacher and principal. And they all going to teach you a lesson. Starting right now. I'm Lumpy Toasters. I can't believe you brought an NC-17 rated film to school and got sent to Holland. I'm Neighborhood Animation. I can't believe you escaped from Holland and bought The Walking Dead, the complete season 6 on DVD. I'm Weather Star 4000 Video. I heard that you made a grounded video out of Sonic and Amy Rouse. I'm Princess Scarlet Angel. I also heard that you made a fake VHS opening to My Little Pony. Equestria Girls from 1998 by Viacom. Real, not fake. I'm Ryan the Mem Maker 1998. Dark Sledge Bro, My Little Pony, Equestria Girls was made by DHX Media, Hasbro Studios, and Screen Vision, not Viacom, and it was released on June 15, 2013, not 1998. I'm Steffi B. I can't believe you saw Jigsaw in theaters. I'm Suya. Dark Sledge Bro, Jigsaw is rated NC-17. And that movie is inappropriate. I met the Go Animator, and you don't deserve any respect because you are always getting into trouble. I'm Samster5677, and when Christmas comes, we will call Santa and tell him not to give you any presents this year and in the future. I'm Baby Mario Brothers. And if you terminate my second YouTube account, I will really terminate you. I'm Sarah West and you should be banned from NC-17 rated films forever.
I'm Leon Francis, and you are a very bad bro character who always watches NC-17 rated movies, and getting into trouble. I'm Taco Two, and you should be banned from making user videos. Because user videos on YouTube can get you terminated. I'm Jack the Maker Guy, and you should also be banned from making user rants as well, because user rants violates YouTube's terms of service. I'm Jessica Lane, and when New Year's Eve comes, you will not be going to Bay of Islands New Year's Eve 2017. I'm Charlie Brown and Kaiye Yes Bongo No, and you are not allowed to make fetish pictures on DeviantArt, because fetish pictures on DeviantArt are inappropriate. I'm VTM on YT, and you should be ashamed of yourself for what you have done. I'm Microsoft Sven, and if you steal my raffle copter, I will kill you with an AK-47 gun. I'm Microsoft Mike, and if you call me a lady and say I talk like a lady, I will plant you in the ground with my tantrum. I'm Microsoft Mary, and if you call me a man and say I talk like a man, I will give you tons and tons of butt beatings. I'm Microsoft Anna, and if you dare mess with me and make one false move on me, I will zap you with my laser eye powers. I'm Radar Rover here, Scotty, and if you steal my bologna sandwiches, I will swatch you 80 times with a wooden paddle, and if you fire me, I'll kill myself, and if you deny responsibility, you will be in jail for perjury. I'm Gula, and if you call me Fatso, I will throw you across your room and I will send your sorry butt to the audience. I'm Andy, and if you dare kick me in the crotch, I will give you a hard wedgie, and you will be covered in skin marks. I'm Mario. And you should be banned from making fake VHS openings. I'm Luigi, and you suck for being a bad boy. I'm Princess Peach, and when your birthday comes, you get nothing on your birthday. I'm Princess Daisy, and you should be banned from every movie theater that has NC-17 rated films. I'm Yoshi, and you should also be banned from watching movies that are pornographic. I'm Birdo, and you should be banned from watching rated hour films as well. I'm Cosmo, and the next time you cause trouble at school, you will get worse. I'm Tails, and you should never be allowed to bully everyone ever again. I'm Sonic, and I hate you so much for making a grounded video out of me and Amy Rouse. I'm Amy Rose, and I totally agree with Sonic. Never make grounded videos out of me and Sonic. I'm Julie Smurf, and you are a bad 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 student of mine. And I'm Principal Bianca. And I agree with Julie Smurf, and you are also a very bad 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 student of mine. This will teach you a strong strict painfully severe lesson. You will be doing 2 million pages of homework every day until you graduate. You will be wearing nappies for the rest of your life. We will also delete all of your internet accounts. You will also be doing tons of chores and community service. We will also take The Walking Dead, the complete season 6 on DVD away from you and give it to Lazy Butterfly. You are also banned for making fake VHS openings for good. You also owe Lazy Butterfly $50,000 fine for illegal possession of rated NC-17 films. There will be no porn, no peaches and cream, no rated NC-17 films, no Grand Theft Auto games, no Fifty Shades of Grey and no more other porn-related stuff. You will watch shows like Barney, Bob the Builder, Teletubbies, Caillou, Dora the Explorer, and more. You are also forced to watch films that do not come from porn. There will also be no fast food places, no deviant art, no fetish pictures, no friends, and furthermore. You will also forget your memories captured by porn. You are also banned from bringing NC-17 rated films to school. You will also play Crash and Spurrow games that do not come from porn, like Crash and Akut, Insane Trilogy, Spurrow Year of the Dragon, Crash and Ash, Spurrow 2, Ripto's Rage, Crash Team Racing, Spurrow the Dragon, Crash 3, Warped, and all other Crash and Spurrow games that are not pornographic. You are also forced to play with toys from Toy World as well. You will also play educational video games like Computer Classroom, Reader Rabbit, Leapfrog, and all other educational video games that do not come from porn. You will also forget your memories captured by NC-17 rated films as well. You will also watch primetime shows like Short Van Street, Coronation Street, Home and Away, Neighbors, The Simpsons, Family Guy, American Dead 
and more primetime shows. You're only permitted to purchase or rent G, PG, and PG-13 rated films, and no more rated R movies allowed. You will also forced to listen to artists like Chicago, Foreigner, Toto, Bonnie Tala, Paul Young, Cindy Lauper, Roxette, The Police, Bee Gees, and other artists you hate as well. You are also forced to listen to girl music like, New Rules, What About Us, Sorry Not Sorry, Gorgeous, and all other girl music you hate as well. You are only allowed to eat organic fruits and vegetables, and no processed food allowed because you are banned from stealing people's junk food. You are also forced to eat raw eggs, Swiss cheese, grape nuts, prunes, and other disgusting stuff as well. You are also forced to eat out from the rubbish bin as well. You are also forced to watch girl shows like Strawberry Shortcake, My Little Pony, The Power Puff Girls, Totally Spies, The Saddle Club, and all other girls shows you hate as well. We will also turn your bedroom into a Labour Party girls bedroom, paint the walls red, and replace all of your stuff with Jacinda Ardern stuff. You will also go to military school, and you will do the obstacle course every day without any breaks. You will also go to summer school and night school along with your 2 million pages of homework every day until you graduate. You will only need very cold water whenever you need to take a shower or bath. You are only allowed to have cold breakfasts, cold lunches, and cold dinners as well. You are also banned from making fetish videos on YouTube. You are also banned from making grounded videos out of users on YouTube, because that can get you terminated. You will also go to summer camp for troubled teens, and you will do jumping jacks and push-ups every day without any breaks. You are also banned from every movie theater that has rated R and then C-17 films. You are also banned from going places and doing things while grounded. You are also forced to sleep outside, even when there is rain, hail or snow. And if you keep this up, you will be grounded even more and you will be sent to Norway or other non-English speaking countries. I agree with all of them. Me too. Get in the house and go straight to your bins right now, or else we will send you to Norway. The Hey Dad. What is it Doc Hammer bro? Can I please install Call of Duty World War II on your computer? No. But Dad, I already tried it on my computer, and it requires 25 gigabytes of space to play. And yours is fast and it has 100 gigabytes. I don't care. My computer is a business computer, not a gaming computer, which means my computer is a private computer. Nobody is allowed on that computer except me. And if you install the game, it will crash and give me blue screen of death. But Dad... No bugs. You are not allowed to install Call of Duty, World War II on my computer and that's final. Now go to your room and do something. Dang it. This game still requires 25 gigabytes of space, even if I add it to downloads. Dark Hammer Bro. I'm going to the supermarket to buy some essentials. Your mom is at your nana's house and it will be back tonight. Do not cause any trouble. I'll be back soon. Now that my dad is gone, I will install Call of Duty World War II on his computer. Ha 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 ha. This is my dad's office. Now to install Call of Duty, World War II. Milestone, 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 Milestone. I better go back to my room before my dad sees me. Now that I have returned from the supermarket, I will do some paperwork. Wait a minute. What the heck is this? 
Oh my god. My computer felt a blue screen of death and a virus has been found. That's impossible. My computer can't get viruses. Wait a minute. A Call of Duty, World War II PC disk. Dark Hammer Pro must have installed Call of Duty, World War II on my computer. That's it. He's in huge trouble now. Oh great. I searched dozens of softwares to download and install Call of Duty, World War II. And I saw many YouTube videos to download Call of Duty, World War II. So that means I got this game for nothing. Uh oh. Here comes my dad. Dark Hammer Bro. I came back from the supermarket and I was gonna do some paperwork on my computer and it crashed and get a virus also known as the blue screen of death. What did you do? Um, I didn't do anything that made your computer crash and get a virus also known as the blue screen of death. Tell me the truth right now or you will not be hanging out with your Dark Mario friends for the rest of your life. Okay okay. I installed Call of Duty World War II on your computer because I was so bored. And I tried to play it on my computer but it wouldn't let me. I'm really sorry. Dark Hammer Bro. Didn't I tell you that my computer was going to crash and give me a virus also known as the blue screen of death if you installed Call of Duty, World War II? That's it. The grounds and grounds and grounds and grounds and grounds it for 6,000 years. But Dad, I'm really sorry. Apology denied. Go to bed now. Wow. Dark Koopa, it's time for you to go to school. Oh, come on. Dad. I just woke up and I was just about to watch cab videos on YouTube. And I haven't even had a chance to eat breakfast yet. Dark Koopa. What did I tell you about watching YouTube videos when it's time for you to go to school? Turn it off right now. Yeah, I know. I can watch Super Mario Logan on YouTube after I get home from school and after I do my homework. Now follow me outside. You are going to school and that's final. Okay, Dad. What are you waiting for? Let's just get in the car and go. I want to just get this crappy school day over with. Well Dark Koopa, my car's broken. So, you'll have to take the school bus, which is what we're waiting for. And since when your car is broken Dad? Well, it broke yesterday when I was coming home from work. Huh. That's really weird. Because it seemed like it was running fine when you pulled up onto the driveway. Dad. Stop making excuses. I know you're just too lazy to drive me to school. So that's why you're making me take the bus. And don't you have off from work today? Wow. It seems like your car is just conveniently broken when you don't need it. So you couldn't drive it. Dark Koopa. That's enough. Stop breaking the fourth wall. The bus is already here. So just get on it. Oh my god. It's sex on this bus. Hey Perikepa. How do you stand this crap? Well, Dark Cooper. It's really not that bad once you get used to it. Yes, it is. It sucks. Hey. Why are you even on the bus anyway? I thought your dad dropped you off to school. Well, my dad is a stupid piece of crap who just didn't feel like driving me to school today. Oh, okay. That explains it. Well, I really wish that my dad would have dropped me off to school. Because it doesn't seem like this bus has any form of air conditioning. Well, it actually does. Only you have to sit towards the front to actually feel the cool air. Then why are we sitting in the back? Because the front is full. Well, you know what? I don't think it's fair that those people at the front are sitting where they are. I bet they ride this bus every day and I don't ride it all the time. So? So I think since I don't ride on this bus, I should have the best possible experience. Therefore, I should be sitting in the best spot. Well, there's nothing you can do about it now. Yes, there is. I can hijack the bus and accelerate really fast so it pushes everyone to the back. That way, I can sit towards the front of the bus. Dark Cooper. Are you redneck or something? That sound like a very bad idea. 
Well, I guess I am. Because I think it sounds like a great idea. Kid. What are you doing? Go sit back down. Whoa. Hey. Stop it. Hey, babe. Do you want to watch TV with me? Sure. Wait a second. What's this? Breaking news! A school bus has just crashed into Portland Central Police Station. Dozens of people on the bus were injured and sends a few students in serious condition at Portland City Hospital. The bus was hijacked and ran onto the police station by Dark Mario and the character named Dark Cooper. Despite the ignore who crashed the bus, Dark Cooper only sustained minor cuts and bruises. This is terrible. I think Dark Kepper was on that school bus. What if he did not survive the accident? Oh no! Could this be it? Could we have lost our son? Grace, were you even listening to breaking news on TV? Dark Coop is fine. He only sustained minor cuts and bruises. Oh thank goodness he's still alive. I would hate to lose him. Well, I think this will make you change your mind. Guess what else they said? What did they say? They said that Dark Koopa was the one who crashed the goddamn school bus into the police station. That little baka is going to be so oh 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 grounded. Boom. Hi mom and dad. Dark Koopa 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 Oh 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 you're grounded, 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 grounded for over 999 trillion, 999 billion, 999 million, 999,000, 999 years. Go to your room right now. Oh. It looks like a police officer is coming to arrest you. The... Are you Dark Koopa? Tell him. Yes, I am. Do you know that you have put few injured students into serious condition and even put one student in critical condition? Boom, boom, boom. I don't know. Well, you are under arrest. Get in the police car now and I will take you to jail. The... This is your jail cell, where you will have no toilet, no sink, no air conditioning, and nothing else whatsoever except for crappy and uncomfortable bed. No 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 to remain silent and you are not allowed to make any statement from you. Good life forever. One month later. Okay, Dark Koopa. You have some visitors. Dark Koopa. We want to tell you something. Are you bailing me out of jail? No. We have come here to tell you that we decided to ground you forever instead of 999 trillion, 999 billion, 999 million, 999 thousand, 999 years. And also, when you complete jail time without parole, you will not go to any public places ever again without probation. Sayonaradanawatawarebukban. The...
I'm going to set radar over Sir Scotty's house on fire. <laughs> Yay! I set radar over Sir Scotty's house on fire. Yay! I set radar over Sir Scotty's house on fire. Oh no! It's radar over Sir Scotty. Oh oh my god! Please grow! I can't believe you set my house on fire! That's it! I'm following your parents! And after that, I'm following the fire department to put out the fire before my house burns down to the ground! Hello! Please grow's parents! You wouldn't believe what your son did. He set my house on fire. Ground him for what he has done, please. Okay. Thanks. Goodbye. Oh my god. Blaze bro. We can't believe you set radar overseer Scotty's house on fire. And thanks to you, his house is about to be burned to the ground. And now he has to live at Beulah's house until his house gets rebuilt. And it's going to take six months for Radar Overseer Scotty's house to get rebuilt. Bumananda. Yem really sorry. Apology denied. You're grounded, 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 grounded until Radar Overseer Scotty's house gets fully rebuilt. Go to your room right now. Va Okay class. Has everyone brought their homework here? Yes. I brought mine here. I brought mine here too. Oh no. I forgot to bring my homework. What? Oh. Hydro bro. How dare you not bring your homework to school? That's it. Go to principal's office now. So Hydro Bro, why are you here in my office? Because Miss Bianca, I didn't bring my homework to school. What? Oh my god. Hydro Bro, how dare you not bring your homework to school? That's it. You're suspended for three weeks. Go home now. Hydro Bro, how dare you not bring your homework to school today and got suspended for three weeks? That's it. You're grounded, 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 grounded for 500 months. Go to your room now. No, 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 Hydro bro, I heard that you're going to have detention at your house. And oh, look, here comes your teacher now. Come in. All right, Hydro bro, come with me. All right, Hydro bro, it's time for your detention. Here are the rules in detention. There will be no talking, no chewing gum, no TV, no movies, no computer, no staring out the window, no food or drink, no sleeping, no whistling, and nothing else at all. You will stay in your room until nightfall. 10.30 p.m. Yay. Now that my detention is over, I can now watch TV, play games on the computer, watch movies, or anything whatever I want to do. Go to bed now. Because you're grounded for 500 months. Where? Hi, I'm Water Bro, and today I'm going to steal the principal's job. <laughs> First, 
I will get out the intercom. And now to act like a principal. Here we go. Amy Rose, report to the principal's office right now. Water bro. Why are you the principal? Don't worry about why I'm the principal. Anyways, you're expelled from this school. But I didn't do anything wrong. I don't care. Now get out of here before I call the police. How in the world did I get expelled for no reason? Mario and Peach, report to the principal's office right now. Water bro. Why are you the principal? None of your business. Anyways, you are both expelled for making love in front of my face. Get out now. But we didn't do anything wrong. Blaze, report to the principal's office right now. Water bro. Why are you the principal? My reason is don't worry about why I'm the principal. Anyways, you're expelled for not thinking straight. Get out now. But I didn't do anything wrong. Toad and Toadette, report to the principal's office right now. Water bro, why are you the principal? None of your freaking bees wax. Anyways, you are both expelled for having intercourse in front of my face. Get out right now before I call the cops on you. But we didn't even do anything wrong. Espio, report to the principal's office right now. Water bro, why are you the principal? None of this is important. Anyways, you are expelled for not keeping up with yourself. Get out. Right now. But I didn't even do anything wrong. Oh no. It's Principal Bianca. Water bro, I'm getting complaints from the teachers that you are falsely expelling students for nothing and you stole my job. Is this true? Um, 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 um. Um, 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 yes it is. Oh, 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 Water bro. I can't believe you stole my job by falsely expelling students. That's it. You're suspended for 150 weeks. You're also banned from working in the education sector for life. Go home right now. Water bro. How dare you steal the principal's job by falsely expelling students for nothing. You know that this is only the principal's job to suspend or expel someone from school. That's it. You're grounded 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 for 900 months. Go to your room right now, or else we will send you to Norway. No. <laughs> All right, class. Get out your mathematics from yesterday. Para bro. Where's your mathematics? Um, I don't have one. Para bro. You lied. Go to principal's office right now. No freaking way, you stupid teacher. Stop that right now. Either go to the office, or straight to detention. I am not going to the office, you stupid teacher. That's so it, Parabro. Go straight to detention right now. Welcome to detention. There will be no water breaks, no toilet breaks, no talking, no listening to music, no sleeping, and furthermore. Yay! I get to go on now. When he get suspended from school, he get to have some fun. Para bro, I said no talking. What? O come un teacher spet? You can't tell me what to do. He can talk whenever he want to. I said no talking. If I hear the talk one more time, you're going straight to principal's office. Yeah 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 get to go me get to go me get to go home. That is it. Go to principal Bianca's office right now. Parabro, this is all your fault. You were lying in class just because you did not have your mathematics. But... No. You were lying. 
You're suspended until December 20th. Go home now. Para bro. I can't believe you lied in class just because you did not have your mathematics. But mum and dad. I'm very sorry. It's because he wasn't hearing, it's because he... End of story. You lied. You're grounded 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 for 600 weeks. Go to your room, now. Why? Okay class, it's time to get back your report cards. I will pass them out now. Oh please let me have a good report card. No 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 Yay! I got 4.0 GPA and E grades in all subjects. Miss Julie, can I use the bathroom? Of course you can Yoshi. Also, we are looking for date and time for your student of the year award ceremony. Okay, thank you. I can't believe I got 0.0, .0 .0 on my report card. My parents will scream at ground me. Oh, I know. Maybe I cannot fake my report card, but I can swap my report card with Yoshi's. I could just cross out and switch our names on my report card. Ha 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 Okay class. It's now 3.15 p.m. Please come back to school with your report card signed by your parents. Goodbye. One hour later. Hi Yoshi. Did you get your report card back yet? Yes I did lumpy twisters. And look at my grades and GPA score. <laughs> but lumpy toasters. I thought I got 4.0. That's what I got on my report card. Something seems very fishy here. I'm gonna get to the bottom of this. Hello. This is Lumpy Toasters. I'm calling about his report card. Oh yes. Yoshi. He has one of the best report cards in Jathaland High School. Well, his report card has a 0.0 .0 and has bad behavior marks. Miss Bianca. Yoshi is a hard worker and would never in his life get a report card like this. What? Lumpy Toasters. I can assure you. Yoshi did not get a 0.0, .0 on his report card. The only person who got a 0.0, .0 was... Oh, 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 I'm so sorry for the mistake. I'll get his real report card sent right away. I'll also call this particular student's parents right now. Okay. Thank you so much. I hope the student gets grounded. Meanwhile, at Curve Borrow's house. Okay, Curve Bro. Give us your report card. And if it's bad, you are grounded. Wow. Curve bro. After all those in grades, I couldn't believe it. You actually got ease in all subjects. Wait a minute. Is this a fake report card? Tell me right now. Um, uh, uh, I um, decided to, uh, fix, uh, I mean, work extra, uh, hard this semester so I can, uh, uh, get a 4.0 GPA. Okay. I'm so happy for you Curve Bro. Let's go to Sky City Sky Tower for celebration dinner with fun and entertainment. After spending over $1,000 at Sky City Sky Tower for Curve Bro. Um, um Miss Bianca, Miss Julie, Yoshi, and Lumpy Toasters. What are you all doing here with angry stares on your faces? Well, we believe your son Curve Bro swapped report cards with Yoshi when he wasn't looking. We know it was him because he was the only one who got such bad grades. What? Here is his real report card. Oh no 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 Curve Bro, I can't believe you swapped your report card and got 0.0 on your report card. 
I just spent 1,000 freaking dollars on your Sky City. That's it. You're grounded 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 for 99,999,999 Google's Optiplex years. Go to your room right freaking now. Hello, my name is Amazing Flying Hammer Bro, and I'm going to pull Beulah's hair. Ha 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 Turn around Beulah. I'm going to pull your hair. Please don't pull my hair. I don't care. I will pull your hair and that's final. Please make it stop. You're hurting me. Bring on over here, Scotty. Help me. Bring on over here, Scotty. My boyfriend. Amazing flying hammer broke all my beautiful hair. Oh Amazing flying hammer bro! How dare you pull Beulah's hair? That's it! I'm calling your parents! No 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 Amazing flying hammer bro. How dare you pull Beulah's hair? You're not supposed to do that at all. Your father is right amazing flying hammer bro. Pulling people's hair is very unacceptable. But mom and dad, I'm so sorry. Don't say sorry to us. Say sorry to Beulah. And your apology is unaccepted. You're grounded 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 for 700 months. Your father is right. You're grounded and that's the capital final. Now go to your room. The I'm going to put my mom in her bikini. Hey, Dark Sludge Bro. What's up? I'm going to put you in your bikini. Yes. I put my mom in her bikini. Yes. I put my mom in her bikini. Yes. I put my mom in her bikini. Dark sludge bro. How dare you put me in my bikini? That's it. You are grounded, 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 grounded. <laughs> now you will start touching my legs, and you'll stop touching them until your grounding time is over. Now touch my legs. Right now. The uh, oh, shut up, Dark Sludge Bro. I don't care if you don't like this. It's for your punishment. Hey Santa, will I be getting any presents for Christmas this year? No, not in your life. You are on the naughty list this year. What? Oh come on. Why not? I just said the reason. It's because you are on the naughty list this year. You are on the naughty list because you gave your dad's computer a virus to so they the tool manager's attention, crashed the Facebook website, always getting into trouble at school and more. And that's why you are on the naughty list this year! Well, guess what? What? Duck him, How dare you kick me in the crush? That's it! I'm calling you!
your parents. Get out of my workshop right now! Wow. Dark Hammer Bro. How dare you crotch kick Santa? That's it. You're grounded, 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 grounded for 300 decades. Go to your room right now while I tell your father about this. No, 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 no. Later that night. Dark Hammer Bro. How dare you kick Santa in the crotch? You know that can get you on his naughty list big time. That's it. You're grounded, 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 grounded for 300 decades. Tonight is punishment night. There will be three punishments. First punishment, kicking you in the crotch. Ugh. Miserable. Oh. Oh. Second punishment, putting a nappy on you. No, Dad. Please. Not nappies. Anything but that. Ouch. That hurts even more. It's throbbing me. I don't care. Now you will go pee, pee and poop as in your nappy instead of the toilet, and I will set fire all of your underwear and smash the toilet. Last punishment, putting a drill on you. No 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 no. Please don't put a drill on me. That's your punishment night for kicking Santa in the crotch. Now go to bed. Wow. Dark Hammer Bro, how dare you kick me in the crotch? You are not allowed to do that. That's it. I'm kicking you in the crotch that. Ayo. You kissed me in the crotch back. Ayo. Serves you right for kicking me in the crotch. No more kicking me in the crotch again. Never. Since tomorrow is Christmas Day, I am going to write out a list of stuff I want for Christmas this year. Okay computer. Take me to Google Docs. Okay. Let's write out my list. Yes. I finally wrote out the list of stuff I want for Christmas this year. Now I am going to tell my dad about this. Dad. I know what I want for Christmas this year. Dark Hammer Bro. When you kicked Santa in the crotch and gave you three punishments five days ago, you will not be getting any presents for Christmas this year. Oh come on. Dad. Give me what I want for Christmas this year. For the last time, no. If you don't. Get. Me. What. I. Want. For. Christmas. This. Year. I. Will. Throw. The. Biggest. Tantrum. In. The. Universe. You're still not getting anything and that's final. I want things for Christmas. 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 Fine. You can have anything for Christmas this year. But just calm down. Thanks, Dad. You are the best. On Christmas Day. Oh boy. Today is Christmas Day. I am going to see if I got some cool presents. Hey, Doc Hammer Bro. Merry Christmas. Do you want to see what your presents are? Yes. No 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 Why the heck did I get a lump of coal for Christmas this year? You know why? Because you have been a very bad boy this year. You have done a lot of trouble making stuff. That's why you got a lump of coal for Christmas this year. But we did you get some presents? 
What did you get me? We got you some Barney, Bob the Builder, Teletubbies, Dora the Explorer, the Wiggles, Bananas in Pajamas, Swizzy's World, Baloo's Clues, and the Hooli Doolies DVDs. These are the only shows you'll watch from now on. We also got you some educational video games like Reader Rabbit, Computer Classroom, Pet Rescue, and other educational video games. These are the only games you'll play from now on. We would normally say go to your room now. But instead, start watching your DVDs and start playing your educational video games, or else you will be grounded even more. Well, it looks like I have to watch and play these stuff instead of those stuff that I wanted for Christmas this year. This is the worst Christmas in my whole life. Wow. Yes, 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 yes. I'm going to have fun right now because it's summer. Hey Boomerang bro. We just got a phone call from your principal. What did she say? Did she say I am the best student in class and also said have a wonderful summer? Actually, she said something else. You are the worst student in the school's history and always get excluded. And also, she said you are going to summer school. And now your summer is ruined because of your behavior at school. You'll be wearing nappies while you're in summer school. And you will also be grounded while you're in summer school. No 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 I don't want to go to summer school and wear nappies. If I wear nappies, the students will laugh at me. Too bad. The principal told us you have to go to summer school. And that's why you are wearing nappies. So you will be made fun of. Rules are rules. Now go to summer school and get going. I wish you guys didn't exist. At summer school. Why do we have to go to summer school? My summer is ruined thanks to my principal from my school year said that I have to go to summer school. I know. I hate summer school. My parents forced me to go to summer school because I always keep getting into trouble at home, school, and everywhere. I was looking forward to go to the beach and make sand castles during summer. But no. My principal from my school year said that I have to go to summer school. Okay class. I'm in till year start 2020 and I will be your teacher for the summer. Everyone has mathematics, literacy, science, social studies, lunch, homework, and then you will be dismissed. Wait, it's January. We don't have homework. Well you guys have been bad. So that's why you will have homework every day, even in the weekends. Also, there is no free time in summer school except for eating. Sorry. Also, there is a long summer school time. Summer school is from 7.30 a.m. to 4 p.m. So after lunch, you will do so much work for the rest of summer school every day until January the 24th. Okay. Cheese. Anyways class, get out your new maths books. <coughs> Ouch. My face. Oh no. <coughs> Boomer and bro. How dare you throw your maths book at my face. That's it. Strike one. Two more strikes and you are going to principal's office. Alright class. Sorry about that. I was going to say in the maths book, you will do division. What? I'm terrible at division. I wish division never existed. <laughs> Boomer and bro. How dare you wish division never existed. That's it. Strike two. One more strike and you are going to principal's office. Alright class. Sorry about that. Now I open your maths books and start doing division. No way. That's it. I am throwing the maths book out the window. Boomer and bro. How dare you throw your maths book out the window and break it. That window costed $1,072. That's it. Strike 3. 
March to principal's office right now. Oh no. Not you again, Boomerang Bro. But, why, are, you, here, this, time? I threw my maths book at the teacher's face, and then I said I wish division never existed, and then I threw my maths book at the window and broke it. G <laughs> Bro, I can't believe you did all of that in summer school. That's it. I'm giving you a detention slip. No 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 not detention. Too bad. Go to detention right now. Welcome to detention. Me and Miss Julie will be your detention teachers for the summer. There will be no talking. No sleeping, no chewing gum, no playing on the computer, no making faces, no whistling, no listening to music, no yelling, and no burping or farting. This really sucks. We have Hunter and Miss Julie as the detention teachers for the summer, and Miss Julie is a kike. Oh. Boomerang bro. How dare you call me the K-word. That's it. You will be. Oh. oh no. Boomerang bro. I can't believe you threw desks at Miss Julia and Hunter the Cheetah. That's it. You are suspended from summer school until January 24th. On the last day of summer school. Okay class. Today is the last day of summer school. We will be doing grades that you got through summer school. If you get an E, you will get three weeks off and move up one school year. If you get an M, you will get two days off and move up one school year. If you get a C, you will move back one school year for six months. If you get an N, you will move back one school year and repeat summer school. And if you get an S, you will be suspended for a year and move back one school year for 2019. All right now. Here are your grades. Hooray. Me and Cosmo got an E. That means we get three weeks off and move up one school year. That's right. Iggy and Cosmo. You two did awesome in summer school. You two will get three weeks off and move up one school year. Go to principal's office. Yes. Me, Starlo, and Yellow Birdo got an M. This means we get two days off and move up one school year. Correct. Buddy Bro, Starlo, and Yellow Birder. You three did a good job in summer school. Go to principal's office. What the heck? I got a C. This means I moved back one school year for six months. That's right, Zephyrus Bro. You did bad in summer school. This means you will move back one school year for six months. Go to principal's office right now. Yes. I got an E like Cosmo and Iggy. Wait a minute. Dark Hammer bro. How in the world did you get an E like Cosmo and Iggy? I snuck into the print room and changed my grade from N to an E. Dark Hammer bro. One does not simply sneak into the print room and change the grade. You have an N and not an E. So you are going to move back one school year and repeat summer school. Go to principal's office right now and I hope you learned your strict lesson. I got an X. Can you please give me one more chance? Absolutely not. You have been forced to see the camera in summer school. You are suspended for one year, and after your one year suspension, you will move back one school year for 2019. Now get out of here and go to principal's office now. Oh great. It's you again, Boomerang Bro. But, what, brings, you, here, now? I got an X. Oh my freaking god. Boomerang bro. I can't believe you got an S. That's it. 
you were suspended for one year. And after your one year suspension, you will move back one school year for 2019. Get out right now. What? Boomerang bro. We can't believe you got an ass at summer school and got suspended for one year and you will move back one school year for 2019. That is it. You're grounded 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 for life. Go to your room right now and never ever 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 come out again. I'm going to start a secret club in my garage. But first, I'm going to call all of my bro character friends. Later, after Fire Blast Baro called all of his Baro character friends. Thank you all for coming. Let's watch South Park. Coming up next, South Park on Comedy Central. 359 days and all 287 episodes later. Wow. That was a fantastic show. I agree with you. Me too. Me three. Me four. Me five. Me six. And I especially like that part when Eric kept in a diary while playing World of Warcraft. <laughs> oh no. It's my parents. All six of you bro characters, leave our house right now while we ground Fire Blast Bro. Fire Blast Bro how dare you start a secret club in the garage while it's raining outside. That's it. You are grounded for 600 months. Go to your room right now and go to bed. And we mean it. At Torch Barrow's house. Torch Bro. How dare you start a secret club in Fire Blast Bro's garage. That's it. You're grounded for 1000 weeks and I mean it. Go to your room right now. Wow. At Hydro Barrow's house. Hydro Bro. We can't believe that you have started a secret club in Fire Blast Bro's garage. That's it. You're grounded for 600 months. Your father is correct. You're grounded and that's final. Go to your room right now. Well, uh, at Vortex Barrow's house. Vortex Bro. We can't believe that you have started a secret club with Fire Blast Bro. That's it. You are grounded for 300 decades. Go to bed right now. At Magic Barrow's house. Magic Bro. We can't believe that you have started a secret club with Fire Blast Bro. That's it. You're grounded for 400 weeks. Now go to your room. No. At Amazing Flying Hammer Barrow's house. Amazing Flying Hammer Bro. We cannot believe you started a secret club with Fire Blast Bro. That's it. You're grounded for 800 months. Go to your room and go to bed right now. And finally, at Dark Boomerang Barrow's house. Dark Boomerang Bro. How dare you start a secret club in Fire Blast Bro's garage. That's it. You're grounded for 900 weeks. Go to your room, now. Man. I'm so bored. I wonder what I should do. I know. I will steal Birdo's car. Ha 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 ha. Oh no. Somebody stole my car. Hello. Police. Somebody stole my car. What color is it? It's pink, with them red on the bottom. Okay. I'm on my way. I will be there in 15 minutes. 15 minutes later. 
Don't worry there, lady. I will catch that criminal. You can come with me. Okay. Is that your car? Yes, it is. After it. Okay. Oh no, it's the police. I need to go faster. The southern motorway. Oh no, they are still after me. I need to go more faster. Five minutes later. Oh no, a dead end. Get out of the car now. Just as I suspected. It was you, Hydro Bro. You stole my car. Put your hands behind your back. You're under arrest for stealing Birdo's car. Now get in the police car. You can go now. Hydro Bro. I can't believe you stole Birdo's car. You know that doing those kind of stuff is against the law. But Dad, I was so bored. So I had to do it. I don't care. When you get out of jail, you will have punishments. Two weeks later. Now that you are out of jail, you're grounded 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 for 600 months. Today is punishment day. First punishment, putting a nappy on you. Oh no. Not nappies. Anything but a nappy. Ouch. That hurts. It's throbbing me. I don't care if it's throbbing you. Now that your nappy is on, you will go pee pees and poo poos in your nappy instead of the toilet. Second punishment, putting a drill on you. No. Not drill. Anything but drill. Later, after Hydro Borrow's dad put a drill on Hydro Borrow. I don't care. It serves you right for stealing Birdo's car and getting sent to jail. Third punishment, closing all of your internet accounts and delete all files on your computer. No 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 Please don't close all of my internet accounts and delete all files on my computer. Shut up Hydro Bro. I will close all of your internet accounts and delete all files on your computer right now. Later, after Hydro Borrow's dad closed all of Hydro Borrow's internet accounts and deleted all files on Hydro Borrow's computer. There. I closed all of your internet accounts and deleted all files on your computer. And you will never use them again. Ever. Fourth punishment, you will be forced to watch baby shows, and you will be forced to do lots of chores and community work. And now for your last punishment. Last punishment, Birdo will beat you up. Birdo, beat him up. This will teach you a lesson not to steal my car. Ouch. That hurts so much. I'm heavily bleeding. I don't care. 
This is what you get for stealing my car. And I hope this teaches you a lesson not to steal my car. Go to your room right now and think about what you have done, young man. Where? Uh...